hello everyone welcome to my channel quantum ideas so today we'll be discussing some of the important concepts uh, related to box and whisker plot and this question is really really asked in uh, sat exams but still we are going to grab uh, some concept related to box and whisker plot so let's get started okay basically box and whisker plot is actually a graphical representation uh, for the distribution of data and sometimes it also represents data with the outliers okay you can see here the outliers basically we know that outlier, uh, outliers are the extreme data sets so basically in box and whisker plot you can see the outlier but uh, we don't uh, that much acknowledge or use outliers okay so we don't use those in our calculations so let's get started and let's see the uh, different part of box and whisker plot so you can see here a rectangular box so basically that is the box okay and you can see here the handle one handle here and one handle here these are called whiskers sometimes you can also see uh, there are some bar like this at the end okay or sometime I can show you or sometime you will see also dots here okay like the ends of the whisker so basically what we uh, what I've said is that this is a box and these two are whiskers okay and the main point is to notice that you can see here here are our uh, graph line okay and here are our data points and you can see here there is a vertical line at somewhere between these uh, two ends of the box and this vertical line uh, represents median or second quartile okay and the end of the box represents first quartile and third quartile and corresponding value of those quartiles you can see uh, on the graph below okay from the graph line so just check here you will get the corresponding values like this okay okay so let's uh, understand what informations are given by uh, those plots okay so let's go so what is statistical measures are given or uh, given by this uh, box and uh, whisker plot or what statistical informations are given let's see so what is the maximum data value so you can see here the end of this bar here this is the maximum data set or the data value right that is 39 and minimum data value is from here you can see that is 31 so what is the range range is the maximum minus minimum data right so 39 minus 31 so this is basically your uh, 8 it is a range okay so uh, to calculate median median is basically second quartile and median is uh, actually the position of this vertical line you can see here down below that is 35 right so our median is basically 35 okay and there is something called internal quartile range so internal quartile range is basically length of the box so length of the box is basically third quartile q3 minus q1 that is q3 minus q1 so that will give the length of the box that is equals to what is our q3 from the graph here is 36 what is q1 you can see here 32 so that is basically 4 okay and another important point to be noted is that mean cannot be determined from the above box plot so mean is actually we don't or we can't determine because there are a lot of data within those uh, range that's why we don't know its data if we know its data from there we can calculate the mean but in this case we can't okay so you have to keep this in your mind so again let me summarize basically what uh, box and whisker plot is basically is the distribution of the data in the form of uh, whisker and box and it gives the information like median quartiles and percentiles okay so let's do some problems i think i have two problems here so let's see okay let's see first problem okay number one okay okay here is a box plot that summarizes the average monthly rainfall of several cities which of the following information based on the box plot above is true okay so we can see here this point is actually our what maximum uh, value of data right so that is what 7.5 you can see and this is our minimum data right that is 3.5 you can see the second quartile or median this line this is 6 so our median is basically 6 so we are 
now we have we are ready okay so we have to check now the option first one is median is 7.5 no median is 6 here so this is wrong intel quartile range uh, is 1.5 let's check so this is our what q3 right 7 is our q3 and this is our q2 this is q2 so what is our q3 from graph q3 is 7 what is our q2 q2 is 5.5 .5. okay okay let me check sorry that is that is um yeah 7 that is 5 5.5 5 .5. okay so what is our internal quartile range so internal quartile range iqr is basically what we said q3 minus q2 so this is equals to 7 minus 5.5 .5, right that is uh, equals to 1.5 so 2 is correct so what is the range of the data let's check range is maximum minus minimum what is our maximum maximum is 7.5 minimum is 3.5 so that is uh, our range is equals to 7.5 minus 3.5 so this is basically 3 okay that's 4 okay our range is 4 that's also correct so our correct option is 2 and 3 okay 2 and 3 so b is your correct answer okay we have another one okay there is the box plot for group 1 box plot for group 2 and mass in kilogram okay let's read the question the box plot summarize the masses in kilograms of two groups of gazelles based on the box plots which of the following statement must be true the mean okay we know that right the box plot uh, uh, the box plot doesn't give any information about the mean so it is talking about mean thus ignore just ignore now let's go in term of medium so let's compare the median okay so first find the median this is the median of group 1 let's say m1 so what is m1 you can see here that is just go below here that is 25 and median of this uh, second group that is m2 is just check out this below that is 25 so what we can see here is that the median of group 1 is 25 that is greater than uh, median of group 2 that is 24 so let's read the option the median of group 1 is greater in the, okay than the median mass of group okay that's correct right uh, this is wrong so c is the correct answer so in this way you can tackle the problem related to a uh, box and a uh, whisker plot okay so if you like my video please like share and subscribe if you're new to this uh, new to uh, this channel you can check out my sad playlist so thank you for watching bye bye see you